What's up, everybody? It's your boy Quick Start, and welcome back to yet another Watch Dogs 2 video. In this one, I'm going to go over five interesting facts about the one, the only, Satara. But before we jump in, I just want to say thank you guys because my last video, Top 5 Interesting Facts About Wrench, got over a thousand views. So thank you guys so much for the continued support. I'm so happy about that because that is my third video to get over a thousand views. So once again, thank you. And without further ado, let's do this. Jumping in right at number five, we have that Satara was born in Los Angeles, California. Los Angeles is an awesome place. It has great weather. There's a lot of tourist attractions, a lot of things to see. Basically, a lot of people love it, but not Satara. She moved to San Francisco because she said she got tired of the LA culture and celebrities. Prior to Watch Dogs 2, Satara did join up with a group of artists that were skilled just like she was, but she did leave them because they were more interested in money and she wanted to spread her message around. She basically wanted to take a stand against the bigger corrupt companies out there, and in time, that's just what she did. Next up at fact number 4, it's pretty obvious, Satara gives off a very rebellious vibe. Not only does she have her own unique sense of fashion, she stands up for what she believes in, no matter what the cause vandalizes the billboards, isn't afraid at all to say what's on her mind. She'll always stick to her morals. Stuff like that makes a Tara who she is. And I guess that goes pretty far back because in high school, she actually got in trouble for spiking her principal's drink, which is freaking crazy. More stuff on us. Incredible, man. Profiles, fingerprints. In high school, Satara got in trouble for spiking the principal's coffee. The amount of savagery in that woman is disturbing. Here we go with fact number three. If you take a look at Satara's clothes, she wears a sweater with holes ripped in it, short shorts, knee socks, and boots. Hearing it read off like that, you're probably like, what the heck is she wearing? And people on the street probably think the same thing. But that's another thing that makes Satara a rebel. She genuinely does not care. She just expresses herself. She's an extremely artistic person, and that doesn't just reflect on her fashion, but her various murals around San Francisco and her legendary dead sec propaganda videos. Predators have victimized the weak and the wounded under the guise of religion. The Church of the New Dawn is a scam. Yeah. Rank in the church is based on financial contribution. Loyalty is bought through blackmail and fear. They believe they are untouchable. That will soon change. Dead Sec will reveal the secrets and true purpose of New Dawn. You can help. Take up a mask and protest your local recruitment center. Let their leaders know what you think of them online. Join us as we send them a message. No more. Dead Sec will give you the truth. Do what you will. She does a seriously great job on those videos. That must seriously take a lot of time and effort. But luckily for Satara, that's right in her skill set. And for the next fact, we have that Satara is one of the smartest, if not the smartest, members of Dead Sec. Yes, you heard me correctly. Satara always academically excelled, and she was applied to multiple Ivy League schools. Another thing Satara is good at is stealing and laundering money. Surprisingly, she takes money away from rich people. It's crazy. Satara's also pretty awesome at parkour and she's an even better hacker and you can easily see why she fits in a dead sec but unlike some of the members instead of going right into the violence she prefers to stay behind the scenes. She assists Marcus and the other members of dead sec by gathering intel, hacking, and playing music for Marcus. She also runs an online blog that you can check out in real life on the Watch Dogs 2 Tumblr page. That's just another awesome thing about Satara. I love it on TV shows and video games where they do stuff like that in real life. It kind of makes you feel like you're a part of it somehow. Here we go with the final fact. Fact number one. Satara's full name is Satara Dewan. And this isn't exactly a common name you hear in the United States. And that's only because Satara's of Indian descent. I was able to actually find another audio log recorded by Horatio the guy who did the recruitment and backstories on people. And it tells you about Satara's personality and a little bit of her backstory. Enjoy. Let's talk about Satara. She's been driving dead sec in the Bay Area. The hacker space, she's paying for it with uh, <laughs> borrowed money. <laughs> every dead sec poster, every flyer, that's Satara. She's even had a hand in our core tool set. 
found one of the first zero days in CTOS 2.0. Some of the guys call her Madam President, but I see her as more of a pirate captain. She'll lead you to the treasure, but you piss her off, you're walking the plank. I had a long talk with her once. Found out where she gets her relentless drive. She's got rich parents back home in Calcutta, and I mean like drive a car in the house rich. They sent her to Ivy League schools. Yes, plural. Hoping to expand the dynasty, I suppose. But she didn't stick with it. She rejected their money, too. Everything she's got now was taken from people she says didn't deserve it. Satara's seen her own relatives pulling strings, taking advantage. She says shit like that will never change because people at the bottom think they can't change it. And she says we're right at the heart of it now, with Silicon Valley pushing us towards a point of no return. Replacing elite individuals with unstoppable corporations. Bloom makes the top of her hit list. And she calls CTOS 2.0 their preemptive strike on any opposition. And on that note, I would like to thank everybody for watching. Hope you guys learned at least a few new things about Satara. Be sure to leave a comment on which Watch Dogs 2 character you want to see one of these on next. And leave a like. And if you want to, consider subscribing because I've done a lot of Watch Dogs 2 videos like this. Informational videos. And if you like those, you can find those in the description below. And yeah, that's about it. So, my name is Quickstar24 and I'm out. Peace.